What is up, Mrs. Buffs Kindergartners? Thanks so much for the question. It's a great question. It's something we have to explain to people all the time. But long story short, we're talking words. So some people use different words than other people. What we do is we go from sunniest to cloudiest, and we say sunny, then mostly sunny, then partly sunny, then mostly cloudy, and then cloudy. Now, some folks will squeeze a partly cloudy in there, but we think it's kind of confusing. And we'll use partly cloudy in place of partly sunny at night when there's kind of a mix of clouds and sun. So you have to keep in mind we're talking words here. And when it comes to actually describing it, some partly sunnies can be way different than others. You know, you can have a thin veil of maybe high level clouds, cirrus clouds that would force you to call it partly sunny because it's not entirely sunny. And then sometimes you can have what you guys described, which is sometimes it's sunny and then the other moment the sun's behind the clouds. So we're talking words. Trying to describe weather, sometimes it can get confusing. Sunny, mostly sunny, partly sunny, mostly cloudy and cloudy. Hope you guys have a great day with all this sun.